Yesterday, Theresa May announced that she was going to try and form a government with the Democratic Unionist Party. The problem is that a lot of people hate the DUP. There are already half a million signatures on a petition which protests the Tories' deal with the party. Why she needs to seek the DUP support is a whole different story, which you can find out about by watching our other video. The DUP are a political party from Northern Ireland, and are arguably the most conservative party in the UK. They've attracted a lot of hatred due to their controversial stances. They oppose the legalisation of same-sex marriage in Northern Ireland, where it's still illegal, as well as wanting to make it legal to discriminate against members of the LGBTQ community. The DUP also oppose legalising the right to an abortion to women in Northern Ireland. The party's former environment minister was a climate change denier. They also have no climate change or environmental policies in their manifesto. The DUP calls for a return of the death penalty. This idea was initially suggested in 2011, but senior members have been saying that it's an issue that should be looked into ever since. Their former education spokesman called for creationism to be taught in science classes. The DUP are also accused of being terrorist sympathisers due to their links with terrorist organisations. They've publicly and politically been endorsed by the Red Hand Commando, the Ulster Defence Association and the Ulster Volunteer Force. They're also the only party in Ireland who supported Brexit, which makes them very unpopular with a lot of people in Ireland, where the majority voted to remain. Overall, the party is about as far right as it's possible for a party to get in the UK. How they will work with Conservatives will be revealed in the coming days. But simply the fact that a party like the DUP will be given so much influence in the next government is disturbing to a lot of people. If you want to find out how we ended up in this situation, you should check out our video about the results of the election and what Theresa May plans to do next. You can find that and much more at tldrnews.co.uk.